Mm. All right, welcome guys to day vlog three from the uh, Cape trip and uh, had a good night last night staying here. Where exactly are we staying, Benny? Uh, Daintree River View. Daintree like River View. Absolutely spectacular place to stay. Um, we had some electrical gremlins with the camper, so hopefully that's all sorted out now. Just got to tighten up my bolt there because um, that came a little bit loose from all the travel we've been doing. Wife is now like officially here because you were here yesterday, but like yeah, alive. It wasn't really like a day yesterday. It was definitely still a day. Yeah, we did like an hour and a half of driving. But... Yeah. So first proper day of the Cape man, we're super pumped, all the cars are getting ready. Pack the rest of our camper up and get the hell out of here and cross the Daintree River, which I'm really excited for. Let's wrench some stuff. Here you go, just that big one over there on the other side. Do you know how to use that thing? <laughs> yes, mate. <laughs> you sure? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, look, a bit of maintenance on the solenoid. Muddy things. Yeah, a bit of water in there. So we spent all night fixing my car, <laughs> my trailer, and now we're doing more electricals this morning. So we had good practice on yours. Yeah, though. good practice on mine. Yeah, yeah. well, at least my, my stuff wasn't muddy. <laughs> yes. Just rusty. Yeah. <laughs> so got the what? What do you want? A stand-up fridge yes. for where? For there. For where? I don't know, put it somewhere. Do you just want to stand up fridge for camping? Yeah. <laughs> My bad. That one sucks. It's so... It doesn't, weird. it's just because I packed it, you know where nothing is and you're freaking out about it. That's true. And I'm lazy and I don't want to dig to the bottom. So, winch works? Yes, very much so. So we're playing a game, and what is the game, Andrew? The game is it's a little, little with a little unicorn teddy bear. Thingy? Yeah, there's a little unicorn teddy bear Shit, that everyone has to have at one stage. It has to go through everyone's car and sort of thing. But who ends up with it at the end of the day? So every time we stop, we every, get, it can go in someone else's car. But it, it has go, to go in like the front of the you, cab. You can throw it. Has to go the front seat forward. You can throw it through someone's window if you get it in. You're good. If it comes out, you've got to stop and get it. <laughs> You have, but, but the consequence is if you don't, if at the end of the day, you have when we the get toy, to camp. when we get to camp yeah. and completely stop, if you have the toy, you have to do what Regan's doing now and walk out into the the, the first creek crossing of the day. It's probably not difficult, but it's all good fun for us to have a little bit of a laugh. So every time we stop and we get in the car, it's just like you flip the whole thing upside down trying to find this toy. I can't even get my balls wet, what's going on? They don't want to know that. Yeah. <laughs> and when we stopped before, it was actually really good because we got back in the car. I'm like, kids, did anyone come in the car? Because Boston and Scarlett stayed oh, in there. So we had security in the car. And Scarlett's like, only Nay when she wanted to see what I was watching. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, fun little game. We'll see how, how it ends up today. Yeah. All right. About to hit the first river crossing. I'm a little bit skeptical about the weight on the back of the car, so I'm gonna, only gonna go down to like 25 in the back. 25, probably 25 all round, I reckon. Should be good at that, I'm hoping. Our first proper trip crossing with a camper. With a camper, yeah. Yeah. We'll see. Yeah. I definitely think we're gonna bring some of the Cape home with us, so. though. No, I think we are. Oh, I'm gonna go this is close. the start of the crab track. We didn't hey, actually film this one. So you can put a crocodile on top. Oh, okay. So we're gonna bring a crocodile home. Show you guys.
first crossing done. Yeah. Happy Woo! birthday, Nay. Thank you. Good. Yeah. 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 Happy birthday, Nay. Yeah. All right, first like yeah. obstacle. Team? Yeah. Were you in low or high? Low. Okay. <laughs> that, that was, was that was tough. Egg. That yeah. was tough. Just everything. Everything. Yeah, your belly. Nah, dude, that's straight belly.
So, I've done a mischief. Tried to fit Raptor in a non-Raptor friendly track. As far as width, basically. I always get this problem, I'm too wide. But... So, from what we can tell, it's just a D-bead. There's nothing there that I could have cut my tyre on. So I tried to fit the Raptor up this track. That's your rim. And my rim, yeah, literally my rim's just digging straight into the wall. And then, yeah, D-beaded because the track's just simply not wide enough for me. The ruts are too skinny. <laughs> yeah, that's it. <laughs> so, yeah, Benny said maybe you should go around, and I was like, nah, 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 give it a go. I no, thought no. it was. When you go. Hey. You gotta look for the little red. The little blue red. Alright, oh, no, no, that, no, no. um, that was interesting. Oh, it just popped. Yep. Did you hear it? <laughs> <laughs> My bead just popped on. You reckon it's worth stopping and airing it back down? Um, maybe when. Showstopper! Showstopper, we're done. 
You heard it snap. It was pretty crazy. Oh, oh yeah, we yeah. heard it snap. We yeah. heard it snap. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's why we were like, what the hell? That's why we all stopped and like, you are all right? That's why I said to Luke, I'm like, I think we just broke something. And yeah. then we went forward a little more and something else went. And I'm just like, yeah, we definitely broke something. It went bang. I thought, I thought, I thought, I thought that would have ended up in here. Yeah. Oh, that's, that's where that was going to work. And something's punctured in there. You would think that that hitch is supposed to be out of the mesh. The chain, the rocker. Oh, the chain hit that. Oh, Can we actually, actually stop? Wait, 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 go back. I'm gonna yeah, yeah. Yeah, pull the chain tighter. Come back just a little bit. Yeah. Um, we may need to. So, I don't know what you guys could see of that, but uh, we've snapped the trailer. The trailer hitch is... Yeah, so I still think we still need a ratchet trap because then all... We've definitely snapped some things and absolutely no good at all. This is a showstopper, I think, at the moment. Yeah, but I still think we need to have something around. Whatever force is on that, or we'll see where it, how it pushes. That's the only thing I'm concerned about. So yeah, we're gonna have to walk this thing all the way down the rest of the way. To be fair, this is like far too much of a track to be taking a trailer down, but yep. definitely done some damage to my new trailer already. But it is what it is. It's not yeah, a lot we can do about it. We're already committed. Oh. All that as well. Yeah. So we um, we're getting it down. It's just we're trying to make a plan on what to do from here. So we are getting it down. Broken. What's that thing? Broken. Two of the things at the back. Broken one at the front. Cheap caravan. Hey guys, crib be track. careful. There's leeches. I just pulled a leech off my foot. Leeches? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Someone want to check me? So, yeah. <laughs> we are getting it down to the bottom, oh, and then good. from there, it's going to be real interesting. We'll, uh, we'll definitely work it out, though. We have uh, experienced boilies. Get it all welded up. So, now. As Mitch now, says. If you this is a breakdown. All right, we'll give this a break. So, yeah. I've had a breakdown now. First one. Yeah. Wait, it should actually break. We should get some welding instructions from Mitch. Oh, yeah. If you can step over, you can go. So, what are we going to do with stuff? So I believe we found a reason that I shouldn't have gone this way with a camper trailer on. There's literally road closed. <laughs> no entry, road closed. Because this is like a proper gnarly, gnarly track. And I dragged a camper trailer down it. To be fair, when we drove in, it didn't look too bad. But then it got stupid hectic. So yeah, yeah, you can put it in the back. There's only calls for one things, boys. CC. Cross the other one. Pop this open. Yeah, yeah. Hey guys, I think that's a great one. No, he threw it up. Oh shit, what the fuck? Jesus. Talk about a frothy boy. Why are you surprised? The trailer was just. Can I get a drink out now? I've been waiting. Yeah, the handbrake's really good. Oh, okay, copy, copy. Yes. So, we're now trying to hook the chain up on that so it's out of the way. Yeah, we're um, what are we doing? So we're trying to get rid of, take the hitch off for now so that we can... Because we're going to run Nick ahead. And try we're and run that Nick ahead. Yeah. Try and barge it. Try either find us a new one or well, get this one welded up somewhere. Um, and we're going to move that onto there so there's one less breaking point in theory. Because the point's already broken once, we're worried about the game. So, yeah. This is how you break down, this is how you break your shit. And we thought we were quite a bit further along than we are. Turns out we're like a fifth of the way that we need to go. So, yeah. so it's about so to turn into a real long day. Mm. Huh? We lion's den tonight for pizza? Yep, <laughs> lion's den tonight, so. We're the biggest 
Yeah. Also, it was but to be, be fair, yeah. where the yeah. trailer broke well, and everything, know, we're gonna go to it, it wasn't too bad. Right. Like, it did. Worst case, I it honestly worse. thought this was through there. Mm. Oh, yeah. When you said we lost the trailer, that's what we all That's what it sounded yeah. like. Is the crunch was like. Yeah. It and was, especially the fact it was that crazy. Upwards too, like, I thought it's in the trailer. Mm. And I was like, oh, well, it had little dents in it anyway. Yeah. <laughs> right guys, had to switch my other camera over because my other one is full. Um, we stopped up the top of a range, we've been making, we're off the crab track now, so we've officially made the crab track, just. And uh, yeah, we're about to uh, head to the lion's den, I've put the word out online to try and get um, a new hitch or something sorted for my car, but uh, yeah, we basically just have to head there now and try and um, just baby this thing and make it. Fingers crossed we make it. Fingers crossed somebody can either bring us a welder or, you know, a new a new hitch would be ideal. I'm more than happy to pay for it at this point. Just need it fixed. So, yeah, we'll uh, wake her in. I'll chuck my seatbelt on and uh, keep cruising. Attempting a fix. Yeah. Attempting. So Benny's heating up the pin because we bent it on our uh, MacGyver on the side of the track. And now we're then going to have to weld the cast iron bracket together with a stick welder and the rods that are here. So this will be interesting. I think, uh, yeah, yeah, boiler maker. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, apprentice, right? <laughs> Benny, he's, uh, he's using the old SIG welder, blazing some lines. What do you reckon, Fink? He's doing alright? It can't go any higher, guys. And yeah, we wouldn't be in the lion's den without this, would we? Alright, Benny's got to leave it here to cool overnight because it's cast, obviously. I didn't know that, but they're telling me that. So, yeah, I think hopefully it will be right. Should be. Yep, should be. I'll have a look. Looks Facebook welders. Decent. Yeah, Facebook welders. What do we do? Benny's just done for the little 140 amp. I mean, I don't, I don't stick weld every day. Yeah, I no, mate. Tickets for it, like, like Wait. years ago. Big thanks to the legends at the Lion's Den Hotel. Yep. Absolutely. If you're ever up this way, stop in for a beer. Definitely. Stop in for a beer at the Lion's Den. Throw some money over the till. We will, we will be.